What is good my ninjas, it is your boy Yinko coming at you with another Fantasy Star Online 2 video and today we're talking about I'm sorry, that was a terrible drum roll we're talking about rings mainly braver rings and yes, I know, it's too specific but for those who like to main braver and I've seen a lot of bravers out there I've seen a lot of them this is going to be helpful because if you have a ring that you're looking to upgrade like katana focus guard excuse me or critical field you're gonna need this guide so you can at least know how much it's gonna cost you so let's get into the video so essentially and as you can tell I'm doing this live uh, this isn't me like talking over it or whatever the case is but uh, so essentially now some people will tell you that katana combat hit count up is good I'm not arguing that it probably is good just because it does give you melee power, melee power plus one dexterity plus one but I just like katana focus excuse me katana focus guard release just because you know once you do that counter it releases your focus and you're obliterating you know it, it raises up your it raises up your critical rate and your obliterating shit uh, and you're looking dope while, while doing it with aura but regardless of the fact so it's three robo rock one coast coast sapphire which you'll get on the coastal expedition boom there you go you're welcome uh, and essentially I so fresh gave me mine at level 10 so mines cost three wobble rock one coast sapphire three lambda grinders one grinder and 30,000 masetta now I would multiply the wobble rock times 20 and multiply the coast sapphire times 20 now of course that's 20 sapphires and 50 wobble rock I would add an additional 10 because once you hit level 17 or once you go into level 17 every so often it'll start failing so you definitely want to have some extra ones if you know if you kind of iffy on you know whether or not it's going to work or not because I thought it was just going to go straight through even though it said safe but it was failing so definitely have some extra ones on deck uh, just so you're not crossing your fingers every single time that you enhance it also make sure that you have enough lambda grinders because the lambda grinders that that's going to eat up through your lambda grinders and as we all know lambda grinders are not easy to come by you get three daily and of course you know like yeah the daily part is pretty quick but we all know that that's not always the case also multiply that 30,000 times 20 make sure that you have at least about I say about two mil on deck just so you could be able to have some some nice leeway and it's not eating up your pockets if it does fail so definitely definitely have that and make sure that uh, you have enough grinder I had like 400 so I wasn't tripping uh, definitely make sure that you have enough of these resources to be able to do it fully i would say if you're gonna do it do it from 1 to 20 get it all out the way so you don't have to deal with it anymore now i will be doing critical feel next as far as how much that's gonna cost but i'm gonna do that live and mainly just show you in depth of how much it's gonna cost me and how uh, how much it's gonna cost you essentially to be able to get that up because i think critical field is a good is a good ring to have for a braver and also uh, with katana focus guard it's just it's just nasty so uh but that's just me that's my opinion leave a like if this was helpful comment down if maybe you have some other opinions on that and sub for more pertinent information this is your boy yinko peace my ninjas